What do you want? Oh, no, 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 no. I hope you're not going to ask me about teaming up. As one half of the first ever women's tag team champions, I understand why you'd want to, but the answer is no. What are you talking about? Are you really so out of the loop? Ding dong, hello. All anyone who's anyone is talking about are the rumors that management is going to have a tag team money in the bank ladder match. Whoever wins the briefcase gets a contract they can cash in for a tag team championship match. You get all that, you dummy? I get why everyone's talking about it. That's some interesting gossip. Wait a dang nab second here. You're not planning on entering, are you? Yeah, I think I am. <laughs> Sorry, I just needed a laugh. You wanted to talk to me? I heard the rumors and I want to be in the tag team Money in the Bank ladder match. Tag team? Money in the Bank? What are you talking about? Ah, uh, never mind. It's already the worst kept secret in WWE. But did I miss something? Are you in a tag team now? No, but since when was that a barrier to entry? Seems like WWE's whole deal is putting teammates together at the last minute for matches. Not all of them even like each other. <laughs> Touche. All right, I can get you an opportunity. Yes! To qualify. Ah! And don't think I'm going to play tag team matchmaker. Most of the women on the roster are looking for a partner to swipe right on so that they can win the briefcase and challenge Asuka and Tamina for the titles. I don't have time for it. Find a partner and I'll get you in the qualifying match. Now that, I can do. Thanks. Just make the most of it. Winning the tag championships would be no small accomplishment. Everyone in this locker room is acting like they've never heard of a tag team money in the bank match before. <laughs> you have? No, but my point is that I could have. I've been around WWE so long that I'm not thrown by anything new that management introduces. I am, after all, the most winning woman in all of WWE. Anyone would be lucky to team with me. Speaking of, do you have a partner? No, but I'm looking for one. Interesting, because I've already succeeded at what you're trying to do, winning the tag team titles, not to mention the SmackDown Women's Championship. We could make quite a splash, a former and future champion with an up and coming legacy superstar. And it won't be my first Money in the Bank match either. I doubt you'll find anyone else to partner with who has my level of experience. I hear you. Experience is important. It teaches you what to expect in the ring and what to avoid. I knew you'd get it. And I'm happy to share it all with you, if you decide you want to give our partnership a go. Solid pitch. I'll get back to you. Of course it's solid. Like I said, I know this company like the back of my record-breaking hand. All so exciting! A Money in the Bank briefcase with a tag team championship contract? Sign me up! Fanny! I thought you were still at NXT! But are you trying to enter the Money in the Bank match? Uh, do you have a partner? I am at NXT, but no rule said I can't compete for those tag team titles! I'm looking for a partner. I want to team up with someone who's as excited about this as I am. You know, with raw ambition. Honestly? I think that's what got me to WWE in the first place, wanting it so badly. I wasn't always as good in the ring as I am now. I get that. 
Sometimes it's what makes the difference and gets you the win. I'm ambitious too. I know. You've proven that. Wearing your aunt's gear for your debut match made such a statement. Despite how everything turned out, inviting that comparison in the first place took guts. I respect that. If you're looking for a partner, I'd love to team up. I'll get back to you. I'm sure you heard about the tag team Money in the Bank match, right? I would be lying if I said I'm not intrigued. I'm pretty interested too. Winning the first ever tag team Money in the Bank would be very cool. Do you have a partner? Mm, not yet. Do you? I'm also looking. We can make a great team. I know I have a rocky history with tag team partners, but I think our shared perspective could be pretty powerful. <laughs> and what's that? Standing in someone else's shadow instead of your own? I could never help shake the feeling that I was playing back up to someone else in my previous tag teams. I may not have a tag team history here, but with my family's legacy, I can certainly relate to that. I thought you might. And I think it's important for tag team partners to understand each other. Anyway, if you want to team up, let me know. How go the trials and tribulations of a WWE superstar who's looking for true tag team partnership love? Huh? Never mind. How's it going, kid? I know from the chatter around here that you've got options, but I hope you're weighing them carefully. In success, a tag team partner is someone you'll be spending a lot of time with. It's actually how I first got to know your aunt. Yeah, I've actually been trying not to bring that up. I know it's a sore subject all around. Yeah, probably for the best. But it's also a great example of what can happen if you don't choose your partner wisely. Although, after we broke up, our past definitely did fuel our matches against each other. It made it better that we had actual history. Any advice? How do I choose? Decide what you think is most important in your partner. It's different for everyone. Do you want a team with someone who shares your values and perspective? Maybe you want a partner who's as ambitious and driven as you are. Or perhaps it's someone whose experience can help push you to your full potential. Anyway, lots of factors to consider. I think I have an idea of who I'm going to ask. Oh? I want to tag with someone who shares my perspective on things. I've made my decision. I'm asking Liv Morgan to be my partner. Interesting choice. I'll set you up for the first qualifying match tonight. This wrestler grew up in the business and now she's growing up before our very eyes. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first. From parts unknown, the Diamond Sky. Given her history and ability, it's hard not to expect big things from this superstar. It's not that hard, Saxton. Potential means nothing compared to results. Let's see if she can get those. This is a woman ready to do some damage.
Here's a woman who lives to find her partner from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. Guys, Liv Morgan just living out her dream here in WWE. Yeah, Liv's career has just really taken off. Became Miss Money in the Bank and then successfully cashed in the contract yeah. to become SmackDown Women's Champion. Time to put your hair up and square up. Well, you don't have any hair, but you get the point. And from Shimon, New Jersey, Sonya Deville. Oh, here's a cunning opportunist. Careful how you speak about Sonya Cole. She happens to have a very gifted mind for this business, both as an official and from bell to bell. Disciplined, driven. In fact, the day that Sonya Deville graduated high school, she packed up her car, drove down to South Florida, and began training full time in mixed martial arts. Get ready for Josie Jane. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Josie Jane. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE, about to take part in one of the most anticipated matches ever. <laughs> Josie Jane looks like she's about to bring the pain. The road to the first ever WWE Tag Team Money in the Bank match begins right here on SmackDown. The brand new rookie and her brand new partner are kicking things off in a qualifying match against Tough as Nails veterans Sonya Deville and Josie Jane. I'll be watching to see if Justine's niece can keep her momentum going here after that big win against David Moreno. She's got an answer for that. Running Hurricane Rana. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. She's pushed into the corner. Come on, big back body drop. Talk about being on the same page. They were on the same sentence with that fine piece of work. Oh, man, by the hair. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. Looking bad for her here. Sonya Deville connected in with a solid shot. Takes plant. Both wrists captured it. Seen some great chemistry from this team here, Michael. Yeah, incredible chemistry. Oh, and Enziguri. That was that chemistry you cannot teach. And look at her feeding off the WWE Universe's energy. Precise J. 
drop kick to the base of the skull. Slam. This pair certainly has something to celebrate, qualifying for the first ever tag team Money in the Bank match. It was a huge win in there. What was that? Someone said help! Oh my God! What's that she's under? A, a fallen lighting rig? Help! How does this kind of accident even happen? Help. Do you really think this is just an accident, Corey? Well, what else could it be? This tag team's too new to have enemies. Well, we hope she's okay. We'll keep you updated on this developing situation. Uh, uh, hold on. Uh. Can't wait to get this space back. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Lift! Why is this so heavy? <sighs> that good? Nah, we gotta get it closer for pickup. Honestly, I'm just glad that you weren't the one who got hurt. Can you imagine? taken out by a lighting rig. No, luckily recovery's only a few weeks. Too late to help me for the tag team Money in the Bank match, though. Even a small injury can mess with your head. Believe me, I know. Did they ever figure out how that thing fell? 
Unclear. Seems like dumb bad luck. For me too. Finally figured out who to partner with and now they're not even cleared to compete. Such a bummer. We were just getting started together. You know, I always loved watching the tag matches the most when I was on the road with you. And those tapes of you and Molly tagging together weren't bad either. Ah uh, yes, your new best friend, Molly. She's not my best friend. Don't you want me to be on good terms with management? Fine, you're right. Lift. I think those championships are so aspirational for me because WWE finally has them. After the women's titles were introduced in 2018, tag matches started to seem even more important. Ow! Excuse me? What did I do? No shade to the current generation, but I grew up watching women compete on TV in tag team championship matches. You did? I have clearly failed to teach you proper wrestling history. Yes! Did you think I grew up in a vacuum and one day said, I think I'll become a professional lady wrestler? No! I watched and was inspired just like you. For me, it was seeing the main event women's championship match at the Brawl to End It All in 84 that gave me the bug. But the tag champions back then were formidable too. I would have loved to see the superstars of today defend against some of the women I grew up idolizing on TV. So what happened to the titles? I don't know. Appetites changed. Management started putting their attention elsewhere and opportunities dried up. The championships, and a lot of the women themselves for that matter, got pushed aside. You did your stint in catering. You know what it's like. Yeah, not the best when you're fighting for limited opportunities. <laughs> you have way more opportunities than I ever did. If I had the chance to accomplish what you can... You accomplish plenty. Take even the current tag titles. Like you said, I never even had a chance to compete for a tag team championship when I was in WWE. They weren't a thing then. In fact, I heard you're in need of a partner. What do you say? Can you imagine? You and me standing as champions at WrestleMania? The Mysterios can't have a lock on this family thing. <laughs> Very funny. Like you could get in the ring again. Did I tell you that Molly said I can't even pick my own replacement partner? Oh? Your best friend isn't letting you call the shots? Oh, shush. No, everyone's clamoring to team up with me since I've already secured the Money in the Bank opportunity. So they're having a fatal four-way on Raw to decide. Interesting method. You know, on second thought, maybe I want to keep this desk. So many memories. Justine! Kidding, kidding. <laughs> Let's go. One... Two, three! Seriously? You? Yes! Me! What can I say? I'm a winner, baby! Molly, come on! I can't work with her! What about the stuff you said when you were asking to be put into this match? About tag teams being thrown together at the last minute, not even liking each other? This seems pretty standard for WWE, if I'm being honest. But what about the stuff you said about picking my tag team partner carefully? Don't use my own words against me. That's what I was trying to do to you! <sighs> anyway, there's no need to argue. This has been decided, and I, for one, am very excited to find out whether the two of you can coexist. Won't be a problem for me. <laughs> I don't believe that for a second. You probably cheated to win the fatal four-way in the first place. Cool it. Don't forget, if you two set your differences aside and pull this thing off, you both win. And so you guys don't blow it and embarrass me, I've set up a training session before the actual Money in the Bank match. You can work out your issues and also practice your ladder climbing abilities. Meet me at the PC.
You know what? I think we work better as a team when you stay out of my way. I actually agree with you on that front, because that means you're away from me, too. Why did you even enter that fatal four-way? You knew winning would mean teaming up with me. And give up the chance to be a tag team champion? Even my dislike of you can't sour my thirst for those titles. Fine, then let's not get in each other's way against whoever Molly has lined up for us. Then we should decide who's going for the pin, just so there's no confusion. I'll get the pin. I'm not leaving this up to you. Fine, go for it.
Trishko, certainly wasn't expecting to see her tonight, but I'd love to see what she thought of our matchup. She peaced right after the match. We could never stand to spend that much time together. Didn't you see any of our singles matches? Not the biggest fan of me. But she came to team with you? Yes, she did. Because despite our differences, we respect each other. And we respect what happens in the ring. That's my point. You don't need to like each other to win. But you guys lost. I'm not saying we took it easy on you, but we're WWE legends. I'm choosing not to process that last comment. I don't want to ruin this moment of getting a victory over you and Trish Stratus. Fine by me, but you get my point. You two are as ready as you're going to be. Just try not to kill each other before the money in the bank match, okay? Fine. We both want to win. Maybe that's enough common ground between us. Maybe. Listen, I know I'm biased in terms of what outcome I'd like to see tonight, but I can't get over the fact that we're previewing a women's tag team Money in the Bank match. Women didn't even have a regular Money in the Bank match until 2017. Boy, what I would give to compete. But since I can't, I will say that my niece has been putting in the work. I will admit, she's not with the partner I hoped she would be competing with, but as they say, you win some, you lose some. In any event, it'll be an interesting evening. And I'm sure the tag champs will be watching carefully. It's the superstar who's driven to live up to all the hype. The following contest is a triple threat tag team ladder match. Making our way to the ring from parts unknown, the Diamond Sky. Few superstars come in the WWE with higher expectations than this woman. Nepotism can open the door, but now it's up to her to see what she can do with it. Let's see if this superstar can show us something special tonight. working woman in WWE, Ava Moreno. And from the Bronx, New York, Ava Moreno. 
The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. Buckle up, Ava Moreno is about to throw down like only she can. Well, here comes the corrupted superhero. Well, I often wonder, does Nikki even want to try to find the right path? Yeah, probably not. And from Glasgow, Scotland, almost a superhero, Nikki A.S.H. Listen, guys, I'll, I'll admit it. The change in attitude recently has brought Nikki A.S.H. a lot of success. Wait, Corey, does that mean you're ready to jump on the bandwagon of Nikki A.S.H.? Absolutely A. not. Well, the change in attitude of Nikki A.S.H. has certainly helped. Oh, she's won the Money, the Bank, the Raw Women's Championship, and the Women's Tag Titles. I think we're going to see even more super heroics here tonight. whether it's 24-7 title or not. Listen, Dana's sick of not being respected, so she's not out here to play any games. Well, Dana's got the attitude. She's got the strength. She just needs to put it all together. Dana Brooke has unwavering fighting spirit. Just never backs down, and I think this, this could be her year. Well, that's a bold statement, Saxton, but one thing's for sure, you can't take DB lightly. She is a serious threat. She always brings her best effort and creates her own opportunities. The nightmare is real. Here comes Rhea Ripley. Unchecked aggression in the women's division. And representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia, Rhea Ripley. Judgment Day has arrived for the entire women's division. Yeah, Ripley was already a dominant competitor, but that dominance has grown exponentially since joining the Judgment Day. She's already held the NXT Women's title, the WWE Women's Tag titles, and the Raw Women's title. What could be next for Ripley? ready to torment yet another victim. What's the matter over there, Saxton? You feel a little squeamish? A little uncomfortable. I'm so excited because here comes the TCB tank. And from Oakland, California, Shazi! Superstars in history, but she is quickly growing in popularity. Yeah, and quickly earned success too, Michael. Shanti's a former NXT Tag Team Champion and nearly defeated Ronda Rousey for the SmackDown Women's Title.
Hey guys, I've been practicing this. Let me know what you think. <clears throat> that wouldn't have scared off a mailman. Is she a rooster? Uh, you don't get it. It's time for WWE's first ever tag team Money in the Bank ladder match. The atmosphere is incredible. Almost makes me want to climb up that ladder myself. Nobody wants to see that, Saxton, especially with three incredible teams vying to make history, including the unlikeliest of them all, Ava Moreno and her partner. One of these teams will watch their names in the record books while earning a chance to tag team goal. She's getting that ladder position perfectly. Well, I'll set it up as one thing. See? 